For nearly 50 years, Tacoma Power has had a successful hatchery program along the Cowlitz River. Migrating salmon and steelhead are captured for hatchery brood stock. Some are released above Mossy Rock and Mayfield dams so they can spawn naturally. Trapping and hauling the adults around the dams is the easy part. The challenge has always been to successfully gather up their offspring from the upper river for a truck ride downstream of the dams. Uh, with this collector in place, we expect that to change. Just above Tacoma Power's Cowlitz River project is a third dam. Cowlitz Falls Dam is operated by the Lewis County PUD. For many years, Tacoma Power, the PUD, and the Bonneville Power Administration have worked here cooperatively on fish issues. Now Tacoma Power is leading efforts to build a new juvenile fish collector next to the dam. Absolutely, this was an extraordinary challenge. It's one of the, one of the most challenging projects that uh, we've worked on at Tacoma for a while from a biological standpoint. For the past 12 years, Tacoma Power has attempted to solve the downstream passage problem for juveniles navigating to sea from the upper cowlets. Well, initially, we looked at every collection option under the sun. Th this is that Successes have been as elusive as the fish themselves. There were difficulties attracting fish for capture, dealing with currents, and designing something that would work on this 21-year-old dam. A lot of lessons learned in our first couple attempts at solving this problem. Ultimately, we need to reach 95% fish passage survival, and we haven't met it yet, but we think we're going to with this facility. The $35.5 million collector is designed to attract outward bound juvenile fish to the northern corner of the dam with flows created by large water pumps. They'll be drawn into a channel that's been cut through the dam and end up in a sort and load facility on the other side. Tacoma Power has had success in capturing adults and rearing fish at its hatchery. The utility is now working to improve conditions for fish that spawn naturally in the upper Cowlitz Basin. We kind of imagine ourselves as a fish and how a fish might approach the collector and what they might do um, as they'd approach it and would they be effective in one area versus another. And we designed a lot of adaptability and flexibility in the collector so it could be as effective as possible. Among the fish that utilize habitat in the huge upper basin are endangered or threatened species of salmon. The new juvenile collector will be critical to giving all the young fish from here a better chance at completing their life cycles. For Tacoma Report, I'm John Phillips.